Hi, I'm Dr. Lisa Thompson of DrLisaMThompson.com and in today's video I want to share with you why it's so important to get better at talking to your prospects. And the reason is that so often we get so focused on the traffic strategies. Oh, if I get more people eyeballing my content. And getting better, you know, we need to focus on it, getting more people on our lead capture pages. We need to get more people on my Facebook Lives. We need to get more people looking at my social media status updates on my emails, like getting my emails open. Those are all very good. But here's the thing. That's the entry point when you're starting the relationship with your prospect. Because your prospect is going to do business with those who they know, like, and trust, okay? And so what you have to get really, really good at is being able to talk to your prospects, having a conversation with them, okay? And this is something that I learned from Zig Ziglar where he said, you are the assistant buyer. You're not the salesperson. You are the assistant buyer. You are helping them make a decision to solve a problem that they need to have solved. So you have to have a firm belief in your product, service, or business that you are offering, that you truly believe that it's going to help them. And you have to get good at asking quality questions because if you ask the questions, the right questions, it is going to lower the level of resistance that your prospect has because subconsciously the one overriding factor, especially if this is a product that's going to involve a time and a financial commitment on their part is, is who is this going to benefit more? Is this going to benefit the salesperson because they're going to get a big commission? Or is the salesperson really interested in helping me solve this problem is this pro you know is this product service or business does it work will it work for me and can i do it and so that means you've got to be able to build a relationship with your prospects you've got to know what what are the things that they love what are the things that they fear what is their biggest desire and what's their biggest problem and obstacle obstacle that is standing in the way between them and what they want. So when you can learn how to follow up and talk with your customers, you're going to, number one, you're going to increase your closing ratio. And number two, you don't need to have so much traffic coming in because you can spend all that money on traffic and getting more eyeballs. But if you cannot convert those eyeballs into buyers, you're really wasting a lot of money. So my good friend and mentor, Ray Higdon said, focus on doing the follow-up and talking with these people because you can suck at sales. You can suck at driving, you know, getting uh, lots of traffic. But if you're good at following up with your prospects, you're talking with them, you are listening to them, you are finding out what their big buttons are, their pain points and their desires, and you increase your closing ratio, you're going to be successful because success is in the follow-up. And many people believe that it's the number of leads that you're getting in. You know, and if you're doing like online and you're thinking of that funnel, that first introduction, you know, when you get them on your list, they're raising their hand. So as part of this relationship, what you're doing is you're getting them to say yes and raising their hand to do more with you with the ultimate objective is to getting them to say yes to either buying your product or joining you on your team so you have to get good at talking to people because remember in this business in this, making money it's an exchange it's an exchange you are doing business with people even when you're online Across the screen from you, there's another person you're talking to. It's a human being. And you have to learn to interact appropriately. When you do that, you're going to see your results improve. Now, did you get value today? If you did, let me know in the comments section. And if you're really struggling with learning how to follow up with your prospects, exactly what to say, 
how to move them from being interested, wanting to know more, and getting them to say, yes, I want to join you in your business. You need that extra follow-up and closing tips and strategies. My good friend and mentor, Ray Higdon, has an amazing training that will help you do just that. Ray, 10 years ago, was in personal foreclosure, over a million dollars in debt, and he learned, he learned using the telephone and by just talking with people and talking with prospects. And now today, he is financially free. He's paid off all of his debt. He's a seven-figure earner. He and his wife now, they don't have an active network marketing team, but they train. They train other home business owners how to get results, how to follow up, how to close. He's going to show you exactly what to do in this training, how to get over your phone fear, how to get over the fear of rejection from talking to your prospects. All you have to do to get access to this training is click on the link you see in the comment section. It's the first pinned comment below this video. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.